Hey everybody, we're playing some more Pokemon. Um, we're almost done with this route. We just need Dunsparce, which we spent a good chunk of last episode looking for. I'm hoping we can maybe grab it, and then once we get Dunsparce, we can move on to Santaloon City itself. Um, but first, first we need Dunsparce. So I'm gonna give it one more encounter, and if I don't find it in my next encounter, I'm gonna go ahead and cut. Um, cause this is okay. I'll be back. Her to get me up. Okay. Oh, okay. Here we, here we go. Finally. Um, according to my recording, it's been 15 minutes. So I've been looking for this Dunsparce for 15 minutes, which doesn't sound like a lot. Um, but you have to imagine that I'm a busy pharmacy student. That 15 minutes is gonna cost me. So, Dunsparce, I hate you. And I never want to see you again. I'm glad you don't evolve, because I don't want to touch you. Oh my gosh. I was starting to think Dunsparce wasn't here. Honestly. Alright, when spotted, this Pokemon escapes backwards by ferociously barring into the ground with its tail. Alright, now get out of my sight. I don't want to look at you ever again. You took way too long to find. But, that is all of the Pokemon Route 3. Now we can finally go to... Santaloon City, the rest of the actual game. Hey there, Big D. Are you here to get your Pokemon healed too? Pokemon Center, sure are great. You can talk to the lady at the counter and have you, her heal your Pokemon. You can even deposit Pokemon you caught in that PC. Know how Pokemon are sent to the PC when you're caught more than you carry? That's where they go. Thanks, bud. Oh yeah, Big D. There's a Pokemon in the back of the Pokemon Center too. It's a good idea to stock up on Pokeballs and potions and stuff at the Mart too. I... I'm guessing this will be changed, right? Um, okay. Um, okay. Blah, blah, blah. What are you up to, my guy? Pokemon are easy to catch if you sleep or paralyze them first. Okay, so. Let's go ahead and buy some Pokeballs first. I don't actually surprisingly don't have that much money. Let's just buy five. Yeah. Yeah, let's just buy five of those. We don't have any more money for anything else, but we don't need anything else. All we need is Pokeballs. Good evening. Uh, yeah, let's, sure, let's go ahead and, uh, let's do that. Um, but yeah. As far as my Pokemon, we can go ahead and basically put them all away. Um, deposit. We're gonna deposit everything, because we're not gonna use any of them, really. Um, yeah, that's fine. Just box one, deposit. Box one... Pause it. Box one. Pause it. And then we'll grab something out later if we want it. Like, honestly, that, um... Fletchling, I might actually use a Fletchling. Oh, wait, did I, like, heal my Pokemon? I'd say, like, Fletchling is one of the ones that I might actually use, but... Oh, wait, I totally did this, didn't I? I have no idea. Whatever, man. I short-term memory loss. Alright, here we go. Hope to see you again. Sure. Okay. She got the rest of the is there a building here? Okay, there's two buildings. Let's go check out inside of both of these buildings. The gym leader is a fantastic photographer. I'll have to go find some bug pipe if I want. Okay, so Um, you wanna hear about them? No. Um oh why is my eye so itchy? Um, okay, so she's a Bug-type trainer? Interesting. Um... Very connected, okay. Okay, so we can stop it. We can stop evolution with the B button. That's good to know. We're at the town center here. Um... Okay, so there's a trainer school we can attend. We want to know stuff, but um, I don't, probably don't need it. Um, how about it? Why don't you trade my trade a bundle bee for my far fetched? Actually, we will do that. We will actually do that. Um, if you know if you okay, Oop, I don't want to do that. Wait, there's nothing to shop. Language like, sell some gym. There you go. Okay, so items are based upon. Gym badges. That's very interesting because that's not how other games used to work. Okay. Alright, we gotta go remember to get a bundle B. 
So I picked up lots of great balls. Hey, Mr. Champion, so I'll share them with. Great balls. Dude, actually, that little kid's goaded, like, for real. Thanks, kid. I don't mind you in the slightest. Okay, so we can buy stuff there. I'm guessing that's the g No, okay, that's probably the gym. What is this? Route. Route 22. Okay, there's something there. There's something there. Okay, which. Okay, what's over here? Okay, they're just like insta swap seats. Can I enter? Okay, this is just like a restaurant. Okay, what's over here? Oh, you, you're you one of the kids you got from sick. That frog there you got looks pretty happy. Must be a good trainer. In that case, go over to the Pokemon gym. Okay, so we can't, won't let us leave whatever is over there. Wait, what does it say? First Pokemon to your battle will be the one in the... Oh, okay. All right, cool. Well, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go back. I need the Bunnelby in my box to later evolve. Let's go ahead and grab another Bunnelby right now. So we're back at the route. Bunnelby? It took so long to find you, and now you just pop up. Oh, done sparse you. Oh. Oh, okay, here we go. Bunnelby, finally, dude. Watch me kill it. No, I'm not I'm not gonna even attack it. I'm just throwing balls at it, because if I if I kill it, I'm gonna cry. One. If I have to throw like seven balls at it, I'm gonna start swinging. Come on, just stay in the stupid ball. Don't don't screw with me. Thank you. All right, Bunnelby, appreciate it. Now let's go ahead and just give you away instantly, so I can get that juicy far fetched. No, I do not want to give you a nickname because you're gonna go far away in just a hot minute. All right, let's go ahead and do that trade, and then we can go ahead and um go to the gym and beat the gym. All right, bud, let's trade. Um, we, we uh, yes. All right, go ahead and you can take my bundle B. And again, I'll keep the other bundle B so I can evolve it. Beautiful. Let's trade our precious Pokemon to one another. Later, Bunnelby. You were good for the 20 seconds I had you. Zoom. Zoom. Surfetched isn't in this game, right? Surfetched is like later. Cool. For Quacklin. I like Quacklin. This is your bundle beat. I will take good care of it. Alright, thank you. Find a bundle beat just about everywhere, but sure, man. I'll definitely take your. Oh, I'll definitely take your Farfetch. This is the school, isn't it? Uh, tight matchup. So water is good for fire, and fire works well for grass, and grass is good for water. Alright, I am not gonna read everything in there because I. Hey, stranger, isn't cruising around town in your roller skates the best thing ever? Wait, do you mean that you don't own a pair of roller skates? Then how about this? If you beat me in a Pokemon battle, I'll give you a pair. I can never say no to a contest, not me, so how about it? Do you want a battle? Yeah. Whether it's Pokemon or roller skates, speed is important. You're challenged by roller skater Rinka. Zigzag- Only a single Zigzagoon? Alright. And I'm gonna- Blast it into the stratosphere, but yeah, why not? With my new frogadier. Alright. You you wrapped up the battle before I could reach my top speed, before you could do much of anything, to be honest. Wow, that was amazing. You might even be stronger than the gym leader. Alright, here you go. One spiffy pair of roller skates, just as promised. Question, do I need to put those on? Um. Okay. Ooh. Okay. So, what if I just want to walk? 
Okay, apparently walking is no longer an option. So I will solely be using roller skates. I think there's there's a different buttons. I'm pretty sure I could take them off if I really wanted to. I don't see why I would need to take them off though. Can I like take them off? Ah, oh, whatever. Doesn't matter. Um, you know what I actually could do though. Let me check my controls. Control. Okay, everybody. Let's go ahead and um enter the gym. Santaloon City Gym. Why is there? What's the hustle, little crustal? Welcome to Santaloon Gym. So, future champ, this will be your first challenge in a gym, huh? Are you thrilled? Are you pumped? You should be. No worries here. You've got Pokemon on your side. And really, they're going to be the ones who are going to be doing all the battling. Am I right or am I right? Right? Jump on the pole there and you'll be on your way to meet the gym leaders waiting for you. Whoop, but wait, before you go, I'm supposed to tell you something. Everybody in this Pokemon gym uses Bug-type Pokemon. Got it? Alright. Shouldn't be a problem for my overleveled, overleveled Frogadier anyway. So. Ooh. Boing, 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 boing. Okay, interesting use of choice of sound. Sounds very wet. Hey, are you a challenger? Come on, show me your Pokemon. And I will probably have to defeat a lot of these people. Oh, Youngster David, that's me. I will need to defeat a lot of these people because I need the money. To fund my Pokeball addiction, I will need to beat them, so... I'm gonna use a pound. I don't know how good water is effective against bugs. Comet punch. Ah, uh, that didn't do anything. Okay. Oh, it's hitting him multiple times. Okay, let's go ahead and try to use a water pulse instead. That might help. Okay. Like I said, I need the money. So, usually I would maybe just kind of go through them and. You know, because I don't need the levels, but I do need the money. Oh, I'm guessing the water is, like, where I need to go? Or is it just a way to track where I've already gone? Do you have any idea how quickly bug-type Pokemon evolve? I do, actually. They evolve stupid quick. Spupa? The heck is a spupa? Is that the evolution of Scatterbug? It looks like a Scatterbug. Yeah, I was playing Leaf Green, and Caterpie and Weedle were the one of the last Pokemon to I had to evolve. And I, like I evolved them basically in two fights fully because I, I was on the victory road. Um. Okay, so that's how I get to. Oh, actually, if I can get to the. Main person over here. Hee hee hee, such weak prey, you've been caught right in my spider web. Is she gonna use a spinda? Or not a spinda. I was what are those spider thingies? I forgot from Gen 2. I don't know what they were Alright, Kakuna. About to get water pulsed. Bonk. I wonder why they put Kakuna as one of the last fights, because it's just gonna harden, right? So, level 17, here we go. Combi, okay, we haven't seen a Combi. And what's really cool, guys, is, like I told you in the beginning, I didn't play a lot of these newer games, so seeing them in 3D is actually pretty new for me. Now, obviously, I've seen them all in 3D on Pokemon Go, um, but you know. It's different. That determined expression, that glint in your eye that says you're up to the challenge. It's fantastic, just fantastic. Is this your first time challenging a gym? Whether it's tears of frustration that follow or loss or the blossoming of joy that comes with victory, they're both great subjects for my camera. This will be fantastic, now come at me. My lens is always focused on victory, I won't let anything ruin this shot. Alright. Versus Viola. Alright, let's go. 
Sir Skit. All right, it's the first time we've seen one of these. We're gonna bring our handy dandy Frogadier. Gonna water pulse it. I pretty wait. Is Sir Skit a water bug Pokemon? Might be a water bug. Yeah, but we confused it. <laughs> Suck. Um, all right, let's go and quick attack it, and that should be enough to take care of it. Yeah. All right, well, we got pretty lucky there. I mean, it wasn't gonna kill us, but hey, you know, we saved some hit points. Viv Vivillion. Vivillion? That's the third evolution of Scatterbug, right? Maybe? I don't know. Again, I don't really know the Pokemon in these games. All right, tackled me. Gonna water pulse it again. Not a bad fight. Not a bad fight at all. Level 18. Here we go. You defeated Leader of Viola. You and your Pokemon have shown me a whole new depth of field. Fantastic. That was a lot of money. I'll take that shmoney. Young trainer, you... It wasn't you alone. You and your Frogadier have shown me a whole new depth of field. Fantastic. Receive the bug badge. With that bug badge, Pokemon up to level 30 will listen to your orders in battle. Yep, even if you get them from trades. And here, this TM com commemorates your win against a pro photog like me. Infestation? I don't have. I'm not going to be using any bug Pokemon, but thank you. Using a TM like that lets you teach your Pokemon some new moves quicker than a shutter. Um. Okay. Now, uh, it's, it's now. Uh, okay. Wait, did it say it won't let them escape? I know. I was like, I should have just probably listened to her the first time. Oh no. Okay. I was like, it's that's an OP move for the beginning of the game, especially if you like find a shiny or something. But no, it's not what I thought it did. On something else. All right. Well, that was quick. Oh, would you look at that bug badge? Nice, very nice, future champ. I bet that schmancy pants professor would give your first Pokemon and be amazed to see it. After you heal up your Pokemon in the Pokemon Center, why don't you head up onto the Pokemon Lab in Lamoe City and show it to him, huh? All right. Um. Yeah, let's go heal our Pokemon super, 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 super. Super, super quickly, and then we can head over to where that dude said. Yeah, it's gonna get uh, it's gonna take a second to get used to the roller blades because I think I will be using them as default. Because, like, why not? Fast is good, whoever tells you fast is not good is lying to you. Um, but yeah, you know, I, I just love going fast. If I just kind of like get used to them, we'll be speed, we'll be speedy. Okay, so this is route 22. And then, what is this way? I, well, you're one of, yeah, um. I'm Alexa, the gym leader you just faced. Viola is my younger sister. I worked as a journalist myself here. Why don't you take this to celebrate getting your first badge? That's exactly what I was looking for. I was wondering, I was gonna Google it after this episode, where we get the XP share. If you have an XP share and you turn it on, all of the Pokemon on your team get XP points, even if they don't appear in battle. I hope it helps you with your training. Um, I work at the big publishing house up in Lumi City. Feel free to stop by any time if you have a next big scoop to share with me. And this is another thing that I actually, like, highly appreciate with these new games, is the XP shares applying to everyone on your team. That was such a hassle in Leaf Green. So here's what we're going to do. We will actually be grabbing... Um, a couple Pokemon now because we have the XP share. So now it is actually I do want stuff. Um, XP share. Okay, so right now it is on. So if we do this, we turn it off. So we want it on. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and put Pokemon in my party that can I actually do need to evolve. Okay, someone. So we're gonna go ahead and deposit the Farfetch because I don't need the Farfetched. Okay, now we can go ahead and withdraw. So, um, let's see, um, Pan Poor Evolution. Does it evolve by stone? 
Yeah, so those are my stones. Well, then, might as well. Let's just go ahead and grab the Weedle. Um, what else can we grab? Um, Kakuna? Where, what is Kakuna? Okay, Kakuna is a Weedle. Okay, so we won't grab... Wait a minute. Okay, actually, let's just go ahead and withdraw the Kakuna. I don't know why we would with withdraw the Weedle. Um, that's a stone Pokemon. We could probably grab a Bunnelby, Pidgey, Bidoof, and Zigzagoon. So those Pokemon will be good to level up and get those kind of out of the way early. Then as we evolve them, we'll get rid of them and, you know, go from there. Okay, so, what route is this? We still haven't figured out what route this is. Route 4. Okay, so, my question, Route 22, can we actually do anything here? I learned all my Pokemon battling techniques from Viola, the gym leader. Why? Rising Star Louise? How strong are her Pokemon? Did, did I make a mistake coming to Route 22? Why are they so weak? Um... We didn't kill it. Okay, so I think this is one of those places... A special racing arena. Okay. Well, I guess we can try to grab the things that are here. A Bunnelby 3, Pidgey 4... Yeah, we're gonna get a lot of these for the rest of the game. No, okay, Litleo, that's kinda cool. Actually, Litleo is one of the Pokémon we can catch on this route, too. I'm gonna give it a Water Pulse. Ooh! On this route, we can catch a Riolu. Oh, on this route, we could also catch a Farfetch'd. Um, didn't have to trade for it, but we did anyway. Alright, lots of things to press. Okay. Alright, we might, we might be even stronger than you. Well, we just beat her, so we probably are. So we need... Only thing we need is a Litleo, Psyduck, Litleo, Psyduck, Riolu. Come on, Goldine, let's show them what we're made of. Okie dokie, bud. Again, seeing a lot of these animations is pretty cool. Like seeing the Goldene actually move. I like it. It's very nice. I'll smack you in the face. Um, didn't kill you, but that's how it Defense fell. Gonna use a quick attack. Bonk. So actually. Litleo is a pretty cool Pokemon, and so is Riolu. So, maybe I'll actually... Might keep Riolu on my team, like, as my actual team. Um, but we'll decide that later. Um, we'll probably just catch it for now and kind of decide later what we actually want to do with it. But I definitely want to catch one. It's a 5%, though, so it's not a very easy catch. Again, the dust parts itself took me, like, 20 minutes. The 15 minutes this episode and the 5 minutes, maybe more than 5 minutes last episode, but... Yeah. Alright, Kukuna level 6. They're all, they're all gonna level up pretty easily for a little while here. Goldeen, Marilla, I'm so sorry, I'll get you both healed up right away at the Pokemon Center. Wait, what? Yellow flowers? What the heck is a yellow flower? I don't know what that means. We'll probably figure it out later, though. So there's a few trainers here. I definitely want to get whatever that is up there, though. Oh, I need cup for that, don't I? Okay. And... Bidoof. 
I do not need you, Bidoof. I need all of your other buddies. I'm just gonna go and run. A lot of these fights aren't even worth it now. Oh, we fought you, we fought you, okay. The trick to raising a lower Pokemon is to keep it on the top left spot in your party. Then, as soon as you go into it, quickly switch it out. Not if you have an XP share. Um, famous Rhymehorn Racer. I even went to the faraway regions to watch race cheer on. So yeah, if I want to give it all to that one, then yeah, that's or a bigger share, I could do that. But honestly, I've got to evolve multiple Pokemon at once. So I might as well just disperse it. Is battling Pokemon just a hobby to you, or do you want to become a pro? Nah, I just want to catch them all, to be honest. My Rising Star Lord? Loy? Alright, a real loon. We can find one of those on this route, if we get lucky. Let's go on a Water Pulse it. Bonk. Yeah, Riolu definitely is in contention for one of the Pokemon I want, just on my team. Um, But again, I don't know. This game has a lot of cool Pokemon, like a lot of them, so... You know, I'll definitely have to decide that at some later point. You know what this is, right? It's the beginning of a Pokemon battle. Nah, man, I th thought we were about to have a TCG battle. I don't know, man. I'm... Dialogue. Water Pulse. Uh, Frogadier. Let's get an email. No, nothing important. More levels. Metapod. I like Metapod. Metapod is pretty litty. I'm gonna water pulse the poop out of you. Yo, am I tripping? Did we never get a Caterpie? Yo, yo, real quick. I think I must be tripping. Did we never get a Caterpie? I'll have to double check my box. Alright, here we go. Actually, that didn't take as long as I thought it would. Alright, I can't believe I almost forgot you, Caterpie. That is my mistake. I always get Caterpie confused with Weedle. Because what I was looking at is... I, I saw that they weren't version exclusives, and I was like, Kakuna? Because I caught a Kakuna and a Weedle, thinking the Kakuna involved into whatever Caterpie was supposed to get into, and I'm like, wait a minute, that is not the case in the slightest. For protection, it releases a horrible stench from the antenna on its head to drive away enemies. Okay, we will... Um, also... Evolve Caterpie it later. But, um, we just have to really quickly go back and grab it. Alright, let's go back to Route 22 and finish up what we were doing here. Now we're getting we're getting pretty solid with the skates now. I'm, I'm kind of feeling it. Alright, we were right, we were chilling right here. We fought that dude. Let's go ahead and fight the rest of these guys. Go, go, bundle me. We'll do this as a team. Alright, school goal school goal boil school girl Mackenzie. Single bundle beat. You love to see it. I love it when they have a single strong Pokemon, because you know, one water pulse and I get that catch. I don't like it when they have like five weak Pokemon, because they're easier battles and they're just take longer, you know. I like the I say that as a hard battle, but obviously it's not gonna be hard, but you know. Alright, Pidgey level nine. Learn Gust? Okay. I'll tell you the truth, Bumblebee is the only Pokemon I've got. That wasn't much of a question, to be honest, but... Hello? See, so you can jump over it. That's a, if you Okay, so that's a one-way. I'll care less about battling than just showing my awesome Pokemon off. Oh, oh, he only, only has one. Okay. Flabebe? That's a new Pokemon. Very cool. Let's go ahead and, um, I think it's a grass type, but we'll just use Water Pulse. 
Okay, cool. Sorry, little baby. Level 19. Here we go. And the rest of the team got some XP. Oh no, Flubaby, are you okay? It's all my fault. Man, it's a little, it's a little your fault. Alright, so here we can come back when we can surf. Okay, over there is probably the building or... Okay, so let's quickly go back and we have to catch the rest of the Pokemon from here. But once again, that includes... Um... Not you. I'm looking for a Psyduck, Litleo, and Riolu. So I will be back when I see one of those Pokemon. Oh, we got the one that we wanted right away. Look at that. I was I just pulled out my phone. This is literally the second encounter. Alright, let's go ahead and um this one is the one we're gonna want to throw the great ball at. Um, I'm not really gonna play around this Riolu. I don't wanna kill it. Alright, whatever. That's alright. I would expect Riolu to be a little harder to catch. And again, I could definitely hurt it, but I just don't want to deal with it, to be a hundred. And I did get a bit of money from that gym, so I could just buy more Pokeballs if I needed. Not like I'll need potions or anything. Okay. This next one will get it. Oh, for sure, for sure. No problem. Alright, hopefully it doesn't take too many because... Uh, as I said that, I, as I said I can buy more, but I don't particularly want to. Riolu, bruh, come on. Just stay in the ball. I mean, I like that it has a fighting spirit, because I'm probably going to be using it in my team, but... Chill. Here we go, alright. Thank you, Riolu. Thank you. I like the feistiness, though, so that's perfect with me. Alright, Riolu. It uses the shape of auras, which change according to emotion, to communicate with others. No, we will not give it a nickname. And once we evolve something, it's probably going to be one of the first ones that we take out. I think I'll definitely try to evolve the Kakuna. Another Riolu! Two five percents in a row? That's pretty nuts, actually. Hey, if I don't kill it, I'll catch another one. But we did kill it, so I don't know. Alright, well. Ooh, Kakuna level 8. I think Kakuna evolves at level, like, very, very low, like 9, right? So, it shouldn't. We should probably get uh, Beedrill very, very soon. Azumarill. Oh, here we go. All right. Um, once again, I I hit it. I'm gonna kill it. So let's just throw some pokeballs at it and call it a day. One, two. There we go, Lilio. I've been I've been pranked. It's alright, we'll go we'll go ahead and do it on the next one. One, two, three. Good. Alright, thank you, Lilio. He pranked me a little bit on that one, but sorry. Alright, so now we just need we got Riolu, Litleo, we just need a Psyduck. The stronger the opponent faces, the more heat surges from its mane, and the more powerful close through some about its body. Alright. Thank you for the Litleo, and tell me if I'm wrong, but the female and male Litleos are different? Psyduck. Okay, I'm like, I think that's Psyduck's reflection. Pretty sure that is. Alright, we actually found the Pokemon on this one not too badly. Alright. 
Ah, you dummy. Why'd you have to do that? You were so close. Alright, Psyduck, stay in the ball. And I'm definitely gonna have to go buy some more now because I've used all of them. Partly on the Riolu, I threw like five or six of them. Come on, Psyduck! I actually don't have many balls left. Please don't escape too many more. I only got five. One. Ah, there we go. Alright, Psyduck was caught. Very cool. And, guys, I think this is where we're gonna end off the episode, unless something evolves. Um... It constantly racked by a headache. When the headache turns intense, it begins using mysterious powers. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, next episode, we will go ahead and... We will go to that racing thing. Okay, and here's the far-fetched. If I didn't trade for it, this is what I would need to get. But I don't need to get it because I traded for it. Um, but next episode, I think there's some form of racing track over here. Um, so we'll end up doing that, but... Um, Next episode.